everyone this is me Gediminas and today I'm gonna show you detailed step by step how to make this tire punching bag just like mine so all you need is to go to closest car service and get some old free tires they're gonna give you for free tires I have no doubt so all we're gonna need today is one big old truck tire seven simple old car tires a lot of bricks 28 bolts, 28 this, 56 this, 4 ropes, 1 drill and some tools. So step number one, we must have a huge tire from a truck or a tractor or something else and this tire must be as huge as possible, as heavier as possible and because this tire will work like a foundation, like a basic for our entire tire punching bag. So this must be as huge and as heavy as possible. So, um, so for extra weight inside this tire I'm gonna put a lot of bricks. Just old bricks. If you don't have bricks you can use uh, stones or rocks or something else. But it must be solid and very very heavy. So let's begin. So this is it, now we have a huge and heavy tire in the bottom of our entire tire punching bag, only this tire, only this tire now can weight about 250 and or maybe even 300 kilos, so now we have a solid and heavy basic foundation for all our entire tire punching bag so now we are sure that when we gonna kick or punching our entire tire punch, punching bag won't flip over so this is it so you can see how many bricks I put inside to connect tires with each other I'm gonna use these bolts these bolts are one centimeter diameter but the drill which I'm gonna use it is a little bit wider is it is about 12 millimeter diameter so let's begin now we're gonna take a drill and do four holes wherever we want in a basic tire so now we have four holes now I'm gonna show you how to mark places where we have to drill another holes in another tire. So I put all those four bolts in a, in those holes and now what we're gonna do, we're gonna take a little bit dirt, wet dirt and put a, a little bit dirt mud on top of those bolts. Now I'm gonna take second tire and put exactly in the center of first tire just like that BAM and what we have we have four marks one bolt mark second third and four so we can drill another tire And now we have four holes exactly the same places where it was there. And now we can connect these two tires. So now we can connect these two tires. So we take bolt and this little stuff, put inside the hole. On the other side of the bolt put these two things. And use these two tools. And this is it. This tire is now connected with this huge tire. So let's move on. So the same thing we're gonna do with another tire. So we're gonna do four holes. Put some mud. Put another tire exactly in the center of first tire. Bam! I have one tip for you. After drilling holes in a tire, if you want uh, much easier to find holes, so all you need to do is to draw 
a straight line through these tires so after drilling holes when you put this tire on the on the top of first tire you will all you have to do is to make sure that this line is straight so you can easily find where is holes so this is my tip once again one bolt and one this and we're gonna put this inside the hole and connect tires put these two things on the other side of the bolt and once again we're gonna use these two tools and that's it so the same thing we're gonna do with other five tires but before that we have to attach these four ropes to our tire punching bag inside the tire punching bag so these four ropes will give us extra stability so now we must have four wooden plates and in the middle of the plate we're gonna put wooden screw just like that and now we have to attach this in the bottom of tire just like that and now we can connect one side of the rope and that's it and that's it all four ropes are done so we now can continue our job so tire punching bag is almost done so next step what we're gonna do we're gonna take this rope and now we're gonna cross this rope and one side of the rope is attached there in the bottom and the next uh, next side of the rope is gonna be attached somewhere here and this is it all four ropes are attached to tires so what these four tires doing in this tire punching bag so these ropes work like like I said before like a extra stability so now they are very tightly and keep on tension so if I'm gonna kick or punch from this side and this rope gonna keep all tension and gonna keep all stress and this rope won't let all tire punching bag lean forward this way and if I kick or punch from this side this rope gonna keep all tension and stress and this rope won't let all tire punching bag swing in this side so this rope work for extra stability like I said this before and that's it tire punching bag is already done so I very hope that this video will be helpful for you and see you soon